Well, welcome back, riders. We're here, Six Flags New England. I got Alex again. Yep. Hello, and Coaster Three Six Five on YouTube. On, How's it going? Check out the channel. Good to see you out here. This is your home park. This is my home park. Yes. Proud of it. Eh. I'll be more proud next year for Quantum Accelerator. Quantum Accelerator. Yes. That definitely looks good. We're going to check out construction at some point today for that. Um, you've never been here, Alex. Nope. And I haven't been here in eight years. So uh, some big rerides on Wicked Cyclone and Superman and. We're gonna do all the credits with you, so get all your thoughts throughout the day and stuff. Uh, you know, in the mid tier, Six Flags, you would agree. We'll see what I yeah, feel. Yeah, I mean, today. great top two. The rest of the park, eh, that's why I have like a, a love hate relationship with it. So yeah, Operation, great top two though, especially with like Yeah, that's Operations could be hit or miss, and I don't know. We'll see what we find today. He literally sprints over to Wicked Cyclone. Just to like work that ride. <laughs> like, so we're in line for Boom right now, but we just got a Pandemonium. Uh, you've done a Gersauer spinner before. Mm -hmm. Pretty typical stuff. We offloaded it. And that was quite the way she was moving. Call. Yeah. Yeah. Moving, zooming, everything. But Boomerang time. Mm. <laughs> And the ride drop warned us, he was a Thuzi, he said, oh, this is not good, and honestly, it was okay. Like, it's a boomerang, it's not, Yeah. once you've done triple loop with over the shoulder restraints, there's nothing, not much worse than that, yeah. right? <laughs> Everything's mild after that, so. Yeah, it was okay, I didn't really bang my head at all, I was pretty clear with the restraints, so. I was bracing for impact, so <laughs> I was fine. Yeah, it was, you know, they should really do new trains or get rid of it, I don't know, figure something out, but. It could have been worse. We'll take it. Cyclone. First time in eight years for me. First time in a couple weeks for you? Yeah, that was like my 60th <laughs> or 70th ride. It's the ride that made me an enthusiast. So. There you go. And then first ever time. So let's yeah. get your thoughts first. It blew me away, honestly. It's a morning ride too, so yeah. I know it's only going to get better from here. But I was expecting like mid-tier level and it's closer to the big boy rankings. The big boy? You slotted in 10, was it? Roughly? Yeah, like somewhere between 7 and 10 in my overall ranking, so... Uh, yeah, it was really good to get back on for me because I've always kept it high in my rankings, but like I kind of forgot what it's like, and I felt like it was a fantastic morning ride. It's just gonna get faster as the day goes, so really good for me. Where do you rank it? So I'm almost at 500 credits. Uh, I haven't done my rankings in a while. Okay, it's 10 to 20 for me for sure. All right. uh, I think it's my fifth favorite RMC after Guazi Vengeance, Wildcat, and Air Force. It's the best small RMC. That I've ever been on, and I, that's I promise a unbiased <laughs> opinion. I try to be as unbiased as possible. There's just no waste of track. It's very good. Oh. It's you know this is a lot like Twisted Cyclone, but that third lap really adds a lot, and even the first two laps are different too. So there are times overall stronger than, than Twisted yeah. Cyclone. Yeah, and like you said, it was a morning ride too. Yeah, so oh, it's gonna speed it's up. It's gonna heat up. Yeah. And then after Wicked Cyclone, we did the world's tallest skyscraper. Well, if I could get it all in, I think it's Close. third. It's third now. <laughs> Uh, that was your first ever skyscraper, so you did yeah. one of the tallest ones. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty freaky. <laughs> it's kind of scary, I'm not gonna lie. It's a fun ride though. The wind feels amazing. And this one's got audio, which I don't remember. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. they play just various songs. And the, the view of the Connecticut River, you can see both Hartford Springfield. and Springfield. You're like right over Wicked Cyclone, so 
it's really that was a good ride so. oh, yeah. definitely a must do if you're coming here once yeah definitely i agree i agree all right so this is the old plot of uh i almost call it deja vu goliath which i missed last time i was here unfortunately or you know brian says fortunately he says he wishes he did not have the credit it was awful um let me flip the camera around first i always wear this shirt obviously but i wore it on purpose today because you know gib gib used to be here but yeah this is what the constructions look like this is where quantum accelerator is going intimate straddle coaster area looks real nice but it doesn't look like it's under construction so but yeah i don't know that's good for the park for getting that if they really need a launch and you know as much as the Thuzies aren't a huge fan of the family investment recently, that is the right way to go. So, good for them. Yeah, that's, that's nice. So here's the other side. This is what Quantum Accelerator is. Just some images for you guys. Intamin Straddle. Here's some stats, 850 capacity. You don't really see parks advertise capacity, so that's kind of interesting. But yeah, it'll be a good addition for the park. Good for them. Quantum Accelerator. So, Houdini. I don't know if it's Vacoma or not, but it's a madhouse. It's actually open, which we're shocked to find. I've never done one in the States. I think I've done three or four in Europe. I've never done one in the States. I want a great adventure is always closed and this is open now. So let's do it. Alrighty, we just did Houdini. Uh, big, pretty big thumbs up for Six Flags. You know, it's kind of like, oh, Six Flags is going to make like a really themed ride. You know, Vacoma madhouse. It is Vacoma, I did confirm. Um, that was fun. You know, I thought Six Flags put on a pretty decent story, and I feel like Houdini, Houdini, excuse me, really does tie in with, you know, like the mystique, the theme you generally go with for Vakola Madhouse. So, pretty big thumbs up for me for Six Flags. Pretty impressed. I totally forgot this existed, and we were walking by, and I was like, oh my gosh, it's open. So, pleasant surprise for today. There it is. I'm worried about this. We just got off of Superman. My thoughts. Again, first time in eight years. I feel like that's the theme of this video, but first time in eight years, about the same as I remember. A tad overrated. Um, I was a little worried about the restraints because I didn't really remember what those were like. And yeah, they're worse than the T bars, but I don't think they're like a, you know, deal breaker, I guess. So, you know, it's just kind of there. But, um, the rest of the layout, it's definitely a great layout. I feel like the airtime's a little weaker than it should be at some points. So that's kind of more the main reason why I'm a little lower on this ride than most people. But overall, you know, still very solid. Definitely one of the best one-two punches around with this and Wicked Cyclone. But I am definitely team Wicked Cyclone. All right, I shared my thoughts. You two, home park and never been on it. So I'll start. It's absolutely incredible layout. Good mix of forces, positives, airtime, laterals, it's all there. T-bars are not ideal. I was expecting them to be worse, but you might have a different opinion on that. But yeah. I have never been stapled harder on, forget Superman, anyway. I don't know why. I was absolutely in a verified position, and yet he still came by and like pushed it down. It's horrendous. Um, I've had such a love-hate relationship with Superman. Sometimes I get a really good ride. Sometimes I'm like, screw these restraints. It should be so much better. It's still really good. I just yeah. it, it has top 10 potential if it had T-bars. So I'll, I'll always be a little a little bitter towards Superman. Did you ride it with T-bars? No, never. Okay. No. 
2017 was the first time I wrote it, so. Um, yeah. 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 yeah, it's still better than Millennium Force, though. Yes. I'm with you. I'm with you. Uh, we're all in agreement. <laughs> it's not even close. Like, it feels like Millennium Force, but if Millennium Force actually had a good layout. A little bit, yeah. yeah. I would agree with that, yeah. It, it reminds me a bit of Expedition G-Force, so a little bit oh, of the air oh, card. Oh, fancy, fancy. Oh. The air time's a little better on that, but this I is still great. That. It's a long ride, so, you know, the restraints. But We're all Team Wicked Cycling. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Definitely the better. I think we all are. Oh, God, yeah, yeah. Build up the like maintenance bay. It's just so empty and bare. <laughs> So this is my first time doing this ride with the new vest restraint. So we'll see how this goes. We just got off uh, Riddler Revenge? Yes. Or Mindbender. Oh, Riddler something. Uh, new vest restraints. We have a little bit differing opinions. The new vest restraints. I did not ride it with the old ones, but I'm glad uh, that they're there. So I'd probably have another concussion by now. <laughs> it, this nuts. one is very, very like bouncy. So obviously there's no head banging with the new restraints, but otherwise it's a very bouncy SLC. So uh, I'm taking it over Thunderhawk. You disagree? I think Thunderhawk just runs so much smoother to where the harder restraints. I didn't make my head when I rode it. So. Yeah. I don't know, I get like a couple headbangs, so like, it's not horrendous, but Brian didn't want to ride. What's up with that? I vowed after Great <laughs> Nor'easter, which is unbelievable, to never ride another SLC. Uh, that was last year, I've stuck to that word. So, uh, You're not going to make it forever. <laughs> no, I mean, if there's some credits in Europe, I guess, but I might be done riding in the States. We'll see. Alright, It's yeah. just okay. It's, it's yeah, not that great. It's okay. I agree. It's okay. Man. Look who I found. So, so. You randomly found me. Is this totally not planned at all? No, not at all. We just got off <laughs> Wicked Cyclone. It's a, it's a solid Vintier RMC. It's so unique compared to a lot of the others of its caliber. It's fantastic. We had, yeah. I got two rides, so it's yeah, warming up two too. Well. It's yeah. running great. It's spectacular. I Good still ride. might like Superman more a little bit, maybe. What? They're very, very mm -hmm. close, though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't listen to him. Don't listen to him. He doesn't know what he's talking about. <laughs> Is it time? What? Is it time? For what? To be in a vlog. This guy's been wanting to be in a vlog so long. <laughs> I, well, His uncle been, Nate. We've been to a thousand parks together. You're just like, I'm not vlogging today. I'm not vlogging today. <laughs> Today's the day. I'm not going to be in your vlog anymore. Bye. <laughs> you at least He's say choo-choo bye. He's a hater. Choo-choo hi, choo-choo bye. <laughs> oh, man. Choo-choo bye. That's tough. <laughs> All right, we did ride two on Superman. Pretty big difference. Yeah. We did the front. Airtime. Yes, airtime, wind, speed. It was a lot better. That's definitely the best ever ride I've had on it. I'm still taking Wicked Cyclone, but that was a lot better. That was really good. Yes. Oh, 
All right, we just did the front on Superman. Talk about some redemption rides. That's really, really good. Definitely front half of the train ride for me. Alex, this might, this definitely has risen as the day's gone on. That night yeah. ride was really cool. Totally agree. It is such a good all around variety coaster. You get the big drop, you get good speed, positives, negatives, yeah. lots of laterals. It's um, a good night ride too. Yeah, top, I think it's in my top 10. It might be Ooh. above the Gigas for me too. Ooh. So that might be a little bit of a hot take, but. A little bit, a little spicy. The restraints little... aren't bad at all. Yeah. You just gotta be a little finagle it a little bit and it'll all be right. good. And yeah, it's, really, it's really great. good one two punch here. Definitely one two punch. I'm still Team Wicked Cyclone, but definitely a lot closer than it was going into today, this visit, because. Like Wicked Cyclone was running away with it even this morning, but my last two rides on Superman in the front, whew, so good. Nate, what? You want to be back in the video? Or are you still boycotting? Yeah, so it? Superman, it's a roller coaster. <laughs> it's got two trains. It's got a bunch of wheels, <laughs> and it's got hills and speed, and it's great. It's How got music. Zones, it's got man. music. How many blocks? Zones? How many blocks? I think it's got three block zones. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's an ultimate ride. Do you want? No, actually, it is an ultimate ride. Yeah, it's great. It is fantastic. It's One of the good. best in the world. Kind of. Yes. Can I get a choo choo bye? Choo choo bye. Choo choo bye. Choo -choo 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 -choo. Bye bye. Have fun. Bye. Bye. Have fun. I have no idea who they are in the background. We were going to end the night here on Wicked Cyclone, but they close the line early because they do things weird here at Six Flags New England. But we got one ride. Yeah, we did, we did one get ride. one ride at night and one ride at Superman go. at night. It was spectacular. Fantastic. Was Underrated great. night rides here, honestly. Yeah. Especially oh. Superman. That was so Superman cool. was good with yeah. the river and stuff too. But yeah. yeah, we got at least one ride on Wicked Cyclone yeah. at night. So I'll take that at least. All right. So park is closed. We actually lucked out. So. Uh, Alex and Uncle Nate were on the other train from us, and then, you know, we got separated. Um, they got a re-ride, and we weren't able to, so, you know, we went out to the en entrance to go back around, but the line was closed. So, they just kept re-riding, um, Alex and Nate, they just kept re-riding re-riding, even though there's still 10 or 15 minutes to park closed, but we couldn't get in line. Eventually, I decided to go to the exit to get some footage, and then, you know, when I was on the exit, I was like, why don't we just try to push our luck and see if we could get some empty seats from the exit? And sure enough, we were able to. So we were able to get a second ride, which was just awesome. Um, obviously, kind of a bummer. They closed the line early, but at least we did get one more ride after the line was closed. So we will definitely take that night ride on Wicked Cyclone to end off the night. All right, let's end this up. Oh, I accidentally took a video. I'm going to keep rolling with it. I accidentally started this, but yeah. all right. Fantastic day at Six Flags New England. Got all the credits for you. Yeah, it's cred run. Got a lot of rewrites on the good stuff. Yeah. Can't complain about today at all. Top two. Fantastic. Yes. Some of the best top two out here. Uh, some weird quirks, quirks, excuse me, um, at Six Flags New England, like closing all the bathrooms at Park Close. We got to pee and nothing's open. So we're going to drive to New Haven, get some pizza, and I yeah. guess pee. Uh, thank you, uh, Brian, for, what's it called, Pepe's? Yeah, Frank Pepe's. Yeah, we're going to try it out. Um, luckily, they're still open after park closed. So we're going to head there. Um, thanks for Brian for hanging out. Um, Nate, McLovin, we and Dan Hood, and we ended up, this vlog was very messy. I apologize, but we had, again, a lot of people just randomly spawn. And I'm sure with the messy <laughs> vlog, it usually means we had some fun. Right, yeah. That's actually, I don't even know if I mentioned in the Knobles vlog that I was going to vlog at Dorney. I don't know if I said that or not, but I had intentions to, and then we got there yesterday, and we just ballooned, like, up to eight people immediately. So it was hard, so sorry about that. But uh, very messy vlog today, but we were just having fun and chatting and all that. So hope you guys can understand. But, uh, yeah, it was good to be here. I don't know when I'll be back. Quantum Accelerator. Yeah. I guess we got we'll the comeback. Come oh. oh, oh, darn. Yeah. <laughs> oh, darn. <laughs> All right, uh, thanks for checking out the video, and that's it for this whole trip. 
Sad. all together. I yeah. know. It was a fantastic three days, honestly. I don't think it could have gone any better. You got every single credit you needed. Yeah. And three great parks, honestly, all on their own merit. Mm -hmm. So it was a great trip. Now we have to drive the total, like, 12 hours. Yeah, it was so. stopped probably 12 <laughs> hours. So uh, Not all today, tonight, mm -hmm. but, yeah. Um, thank you, Labor Day, mm -hmm. <laughs> for giving us time off work. And, yeah, we'll figure it out Tuesday when we get back to work. That's a problem for the future. Yeah, either tomorrow morning or Tuesday is just going to hit us like a rock, and mm -hmm. <laughs> it's going to be bad. All right, thanks for checking out the video, the whole trip as a whole. Push down, pull up, exit to the right. Hope you enjoyed the video, and go have your greatest day yet. Choo-choo, bye. bye.